It is Friday night, and that means it's time for high school football, the newly renovated Nippert Stadium, hosting its very first game since the facelift. Now, the brand new stadium is ready for the big night, too. Yeah, nice little doubleheader out there. The Skyline Crosstown Showdown. Two games, two great high school games on the gridiron tonight. And WLWT News 5's John London shows us what fans can expect at Nippert Stadium this season. John. Well, more room, Mike, and several thousand more seats. It's modernization without losing any of the charm of old Nippert is how some see it. Even though the glass pavilion that you see live here on the west side looms over Nippert like a wayward ship, the view corridors to the rest of campus are still intact. Take a look around, Cincinnati. It's an $86 million makeover. UC was determined to power wash the outmoded aspects away. The concourses are wider for the concession and restroom breaks. You might move like a tailback. In prior years, we used to uh, have to stand in line at a concession stand in, in the way of, uh, of the flow of traffic, and now that's all been reversed. If you're seated in the upper bowl, you won't have to go to the lower bowl just to find a bowl. The east side of the plaza has new facilities. Students are pumped. They recognize Nippert was outdated, showing its age. Now it looks like a uh, like a real legitimate stadium compared to what was there before, and uh, it's going to be a lot better just going to games down here instead of having to go down to Paul Brown. Nearby restaurants and pubs are shouting amen. They've weathered the absence of a whole season off campus. We were down in business 20 percent during football games. It definitely hurt, and for the students, it wasn't home to them. So tonight's a welcome home of sorts for high school games. There's partial occupancy for the fifth floor press box. We're told permits for the suites and the rest of the new glass enclosed building will be ready for the Bearcats open. Here's what won't be ready. The scoreboard of two seasons ago is the scoreboard of today. The funding just didn't, uh, didn't make it this time around, so we're hoping to do that in a future phase. On the plus side, this place retains its open feeling to campus while adding newness to Nippert. The new press boxes is a really sweet. And here's the kicker. The charm of the university is still there. And you're looking live at the first game day experience here in two Decembers. The sound system folks tell us that the testing indicates the sound here at the new Nippert should reverberate and bounce around a lot more than before, which they believe means you're going to feel more energy here. Uh, the fans will at the new Nipper. Reporting live at UC, John London, WWT News 5. John, thank you. The high school doubleheader tonight kicks off with St. X taking on Cove Cat in just about 15 minutes. And